Well, we have a view of Tortoise Pan. It's difficult where he is. Our signal is giving us a tough time. Hey, can you see him still? Forward, okay. That's saying forward. There. There he is. He's going to come out into the open for us. To the right a little bit, Gert, I think. He should be there. I can see him just kind of sitting behind there. You can maybe just make his ear out right in that little gap. Um, so he's being a bit tricky because he's in the drainage line where I said we don't want him to go. But what's interesting is moving to the right, Gert, away from you. Yeah, there we go. Um, is he's being tricky because, hello boy, welcome to Wild Earth. <laughs> It's very, very cool that we've got another male leopard. I was saying this morning we must have a curse on us at the moment because we keep finding male leopards with no signal. The last few days we've had Inklangula, Tavungumi yesterday, um, and now Tortoise Pan. But luckily we've managed to get into a little higher spot and we can kind of look down on where he is at the moment. But what I was saying is interesting is he's busy trailing, or maybe not trailing, but he and Tingana are about 300 meters apart. Neither one seems to be aware of the other one at this stage. Um, they're both just walking in the same direction, but one is walking up the slope um, So kind of in the direction where he's looking now and then he's walking down in the drainage And like I say, neither one seemed to be at all aware of the other one at this stage um, So I don't think there's anything to worry about but you can see he's a beautiful beautiful boy It's not a small leopard by any stretch of the imagination um, I'm gonna go forward a little bit because it's Hopefully, like I say, our signal stays. But